Hello everyone in YouTube land, Nintendo fanboy, also back here as always. Alright, since we're in 2019 and 2018 is gone, I'd like to talk about one thing that a lot of people were talking about in 2018. That was kind of contra a little bit of controversy. People are still talking about it, people have talked about it for a while now. And it's something that people are just accepting, but they have it. And that is Nintendo Switch Online. <laughs> There's a bunch of stuff to talk about here. Um, I'm going to tell some stories too about my past experiences with Nintendo Online, just in general, but uh, this, is, this is a lot of stuff to talk about here. Uh, Nintendo, honestly, this is the thing that people don't want to hear. I'm going to say it right now. Nintendo will never understand online. Will Nintendo under, ever understand online? Will they ever get it? I don't think so. Like, I honestly don't think so. That's the thought, this is the thing that people don't want to hear. People have to keep in mind, though, like, Nintendo is a gaming company. They're not multi the multimedia company like Sony or Microsoft. And Sony, Microsoft, or you know, they make other things too. And Nintendo just makes games and game systems. Like, that's it. That's all they do. And that's great. That's what they do. They were a toy maker before that, and now they still make toys. Video games are toys. So I think their online will always be like this. You know, people are just mad. People are mad because they're paying twenty dollars online. Why are we paying twenty dollars online? Where is it going to? I don't know. Like, where is that twenty dollars going to? Because the games that we're playing have don't have don't have dedicated servers. It's all peer to peer. It all depends on your internet connection, and it, and, and it depends on your internet provider too. You know, that's that's honestly the thing. Like me personally, like I live in in town. I don't, I don't live in the middle of nowhere. I don't live in the sticks. I don't live in the middle of nowhere. I live in town, so I have good internet. I know there's some people that live in town that don't have good internet either. But like, like I said, it depends on your internet service provider too. So that comes into play. There's a lot of things that comes into play. Um, I wish Nintendo would get servers for Splatoon. Even though Splatoon 2 is not that bad online. Either there's some lag in there or some whatever. But Sp Smash, I'll get to that on a sec here. Um, but like I said though, Nintendo is not a multimedia company, alright? They're not. And Microsoft gets it. Like, they're the one. Sony gets it too. Like, they really do more than Nintendo. But I think Microsoft gets it even more. Like, they just. Yeah, they're just the online guys, man. Doesn't matter what game you're playing. Like I said, it's not gonna be perfect. No, no gaming online service is perfect. So you're gonna have hiccups here and there. Look at Sony and Microsoft. Like, I mean, look at Sony. Look at all those outages they had. Big outages, hacks that people like to shove under the rug. Like nothing ever happened, but it, it does. So it's like I don't know why people are like that. Sony fanboys and Microsoft fanboys like to talk shit about Nintendo's online, but their online service goes outage all the fucking time. And it's just like either it's maintenance or it's probably just outages because it's not great either. But they still understand it though. Unlike Nintendo. Um, and me remember with Nintendo, these are the stories I want to tell. Remember back at the Mario Kart? I mean, here's the thing, I'm going to say this first. Nintendo's online service is not great, but it's also not super horrible either. I'm going to say that right now. It's not as bad as people want to make it out to be. Um, I remember playing Mario Kart DS way back in the Mario Kart Wi-Fi wi wi connection days. Wii Connect 24, remember? Mario Kart Wii. I have so many good memories playing Mario Kart DS and Mario Kart Wii. It's, just, it's unbelievable. It's so great. I love those games so much. I remember, even though this is so long ago, but I remember playing Mario Kart Wii and I kept dropping connection all the time. Mario Kart Wii, I gave up. I just gave up and I just, it slowly ironed out. So it got better. And yeah, not even just that. Mario Kart Strikers Charge was so unbelievably unplayable. If you thought Brawl was unplayable and leggy, boy, whew, Mario Kart Strikers Charge was just unplayable, man. It froze all the fucking time and it just... I can't play it. Like, I hope we get another Mario Strikers Charge game. Mar Mar or what do you want to call it? Mario Strikers. Just, I want another Mario Strikers, please. So, I love that game. There's just so much stuff going on. Um, Mario Kart 7 wasn't that bad. That was great. Some some disconnects, but just like Mario Kart DS and Mario Kart Wii. Like I said, Mario Kart Wii ironed it out. Mario Kart 7 was great. Um, Mario Kart 8 on Wii U, great. Some disconnects, great. So, like, near perfect. So there's not a lot of stuff going on there, so you're not going to get a lot of disconnects. But Smash, there's a lot going on. Um, oh yeah, and also Smash on 3DS and other Mario Sports games too I played. Um, I played Mario Kart Sport, uh, Sports Mix on the Wii. That wasn't that bad. Actually, that wasn't bad at all. Um, Tessimo vs. Capcom, I played that on the Wii. Not great. Some I played. I played a little bit of it. I gave up on it. Um, so, I mean, I remember so many good memories playing all those games, but yeah, they were just... They're just unplayable, man. They're just unplayable because there's a lot of stuff going on. And Smash, there's, a, there's two things here. Does, will Nintendo, does Nintendo understand online or do they care? That's the thing. I don't honestly think they care. They just care about making good games. 
the games are good, it's just the online service is not good. Um, but you have to rely on that to play with randoms online, so get better Nintendo. Um, it's one of those things like, I don't think they care. They act like they care, but they don't. Like with the Switch, they put all these NES games on there, maybe soon Super Nintendo, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, GameCube, Wii, whatever. Who knows what else they're going to put on there. They're just doing, they're putting those games on there to make up for what the online is, because it's just, it, you pay for what you get. And then you get the NES games and the free, these free games. Obviously, they're old games, so they're closer to you. Can I give you for free? They're going to be on there forever. So it's just one of those things like that's good incentive to get the Switch Online to play these old games, games you grew up with, even though people played them over, over and over to, to death. I have these games on everything else, you know, but it's, it's cool to get that to play on your Switch and whatever. And they look great too in HD. But other than that, like, that's all I have to say, you know, like, I just don't, I don't think, I think it will be decent. I think it will, it will get, slowly get better, but it will never be, like, this is, Nintendo finally has it. They got it. They got, they get online, you know. Um, it'll always be this way. I know a lot of people don't want to hear that, but it's one of those things, like, they're a gaming company. They're not multimedia. They're not online, like, Microsoft and all that stuff. So, they're not tech savvy in that way. They're, obviously, the old, old Japanese guys and Nintendo uh, stuff just don't understand that type of stuff. They're trying to figure it out. And, God, it's just, it's a shame, you know. So, comment up below. What do you think, Nintendo? Will they, do they understand it? Or do they care? Will it get better? You know? Like, I don't know. What's your memories of playing other past Nintendo online games? Well, you know, like Mario Kart DS, Wii, Mario Strikers, whatever. What's your memories and all that about them? Were they great? Were they bad? <laughs> so, anyways, peace out. More Renovus coming soon. Comment up below on this. Later.